Yeah, invasive thoughts like that are really awkward to have. Or or try to explain to someone who doesn't experience that. Um, yeah. Oh, you dropped it. I did. Wait, don't go anywhere. Because I don't want to miss anything. Okay. Because like, this is becoming blink and you'll miss it. What the hell? Who are you? She is judgmental. You are. That's a brand new picture. That is a judgmental person. Right? Oh, there's a doll in a cage. Why is there a doll in a cage? Why ah. is there anything in this game? Why the dolls? Why bring those back? We were we were happy without those. I was a better person without those. <laughs> you definitely were a more stable person without those. <laughs> oh, God. oh God! I thought. Huh. I'm just. This game is getting to me. Like, I thought there was a cat behind, like, doing, you know how the cats, like, scratch on the back of the, like, yeah. the stretch? Oh, 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 why? Why the, why the, oh. Oh, I see. Why? Oh, we're going outside. Yay, I guess. <laughs> I see. I see. Yay, okay. she says, like. <laughs> <laughs> Grand, this awesome. This just what I wanted. More like, oh, cool, we got somewhere. Uh, Fraps, why are you freaking out? Why is any, because, I don't know, that maybe it's scared. Oh, Gabby, why? Okay, Game, I'm getting a little upset with, like... This is starting to border on, like, brutalization of women. Yeah. But, like, oh. I mean, I get that he's also getting brutalized, but the images of a woman just constantly being... Like, this is a little... Eh, this, is, this is a little, like... Let Fraps figure itself out. This is almost fetishizing the brutality. Yeah. But okay, we'll keep going. Well, I'm waiting for. Yeah, I, I know. I'm just saying. But so, <laughs> we do, what else you got, game? There it goes. A cave. If someone gets sacrificed, I'm gonna be upset. Is, are we gonna sacrifice Gabby to Satan? Why? I Why guess this the is our final frames? descent. The dark descent. No. <laughs> oh, we're back in the house again. Fraps. Hang on. Why is it? Why me? Why does everybody ha not have this issue but me? Eight frames per second. Twenty-five. Seven. There we go. So, oh, Jesus. I think it's probably loading stuff. Yeah. It's, why my game? Why is my game? Why am I the only experience? Does anybody else have this problem? I don't. You don't have crabs. No, I don't. I look at you, are you going to follow me? Because I don't agree. Oh, this Aww, one's happy. She's so happy. Married dear. Hey. Hey. I heard that. All right, you keep going. Okay. Put my headphones on. Oh, great. Broken things. It's my favorite. My favorite thing is broken things. It mirrors your broken sense of everything, <laughs> I guess. Um, um, can I get around that? <laughs> oh, what the oh, hell? Oh, oh, broken glass. Oh, 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 crap. And one of those, those sniffy <clears throat> monsters was behind you. I mean, I mean, I don't see a it. A while but... ago, but... Oh, uh, that's another that's another evasive type of thought. Is it walking on glass? Yeah, not for me. But why I know didn't you it just is. clear the glass? What? No, not not. It's a dream. To, I know, <laughs> I know, but I see the doll. Don't don't think I don't see that. I missed it. It was in a cage, really oh. close up to the screen. Well, then uh, it shouldn't be a problem if it's caged. Yes. I hear the breathing in my. Oh, it's a sniffer, dude. Hmm. Whew. 
Breathing is a good thing. Okay, everybody keep their hands to themselves. Just in general. <laughs> not just in this game, just in general. <laughs> Unless somebody wants <coughs> you to not keep your hands to yourself. But make sure that that's actually what they want and they're not being coerced into it. And Oh, God, yeah, that's a big deal right that's now. That's what I was thinking about. Like, It's a good idea to just keep your hands to yourself just in general. Oh, okay. I prefer to have a graveyard in my house. I would love that. That'd be cool. There's actually, there's um, a while ago, not a while ago, not too far along ago. Oh, cool. There was, um, I was looking, I was like, I was hunting. Okay. I'm officially pissed at it, this game. It's raining, man. Hallelujah. <laughs> no, I want to be angry. That's not, this, this is just, this is just ridiculous at this point. Like, stop killing her. Shut up. I can hear you. Hallelujah! <laughs> Stop it! I'm trying to be angry! Oh, God! Now I can't, like... Absolutely soaking wet! Okay. God damn it. Anyway, a while <laughs> ago... I was trying to tell a story. Um, a while ago I was... I was looking at houses, like, or not houses, but, like, areas just cheaper than what we've got. Because we're, we're in a nice area in town, which is awesome because, But you know, the rent is really high. But the rent is pretty high and we're paying for it. So we're paying for the nice area. Um, so I was just... Oh, hello. Oh, I see you. I see you. Are you happy? You are no. not happy. No. Um, no. No. <clears throat> and there was one place that had uh that was just really really low but nowhere near where we need but the reason why it was really low is because it was attached to a cemetery oh perfect and i'm like i want that can i have that like that's near things because that like part of the reason it was so cheap is that you like you couldn't do anything to your lawn. Uh-huh. I didn't want I don't Excuse want a lawn me. anyway. Like you couldn't touch the lawn. It was taken care of, but you couldn't like there was no backyard. There was no um the front yard was like minuscule, but you couldn't touch anything in the backyard. Like you you mm -hmm. couldn't like have any kid stuff. You couldn't Oh, it's a broken chair. Like nothing. So you had to like literally all you got was the house, but everything else in the area had like these big lawns. This is this one wasn't, but it was affordable. I just don't want a house because that means I have to take care of it. I'll get a condo. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, blood. <gasps> yes. Why is there dead things? Ah, oh, whatever. Oh, excuse me. God, why am I so burpy? It's this game. It's giving me gas. <laughs> Gives you indigestion. Uh 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 uh. Oh, hello! Oh, that's a good. Yeah, just, just, yeah, no. Oh, she's got cuts all over her. There we go. I was like, oh, cool, good look. In the daylight. Yeah, don't get too close. <laughs> There's blood everywhere. Did the walls like pull? Oh, it's because the light. I was like, why are the walls like pulsing? No, it's. Yeah. Oh. Mm mm. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Anybody want to say hi? Anybody? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Doctor's office. Tina noises. Tina Felcher noises. Everything <coughs> is a lie. Everything is a lie. Yep. 
Oh. I noticed where well, we noticed that last time. The, the little hints in this game of like little subtle touches are really cool. There's a skull like in the candle. Where? Like in that little lamp by your head. Oh. Can you see the skull in the yeah, underneath I, it? Yeah, I don't think it's actually a skull. No, but it looks like one. It has. Okay. God, I know Sylvia's to like destroy me. Huh? Sylvia's gonna come after me, I just know it. Well, that one's nice and clean. Can I live in there? Do you really want to? Oh, oh no, 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 God! Oh, no. Come on, no, get in, get in, no, go, go, no, go, 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 no, go, go, no, no. Oh, good. Oh, good, he can't, he can't get you. God. No, go back and laugh at him. No. <laughs> it's the opposite of what I want to do. He had, like, blue veins. and ugh. It was blue. I should have been able to look at it. Gross. <clears throat> Why? Why the random intestines? Just who who leaves these out? What cat is bringing these in? <laughs> oh, that, uh, that's beautiful. Uh, Some modern artwork going on, or something. I like how there's uh, blood and body parts and a vulture. Well, he feels very at home around right. the blood and body parts. Oh, God. <laughs> God. Uh, I don't wanna. Oh, in the corner. Top, where? top corner. Oh, is that a? Top right, it's a doll. Yeah. Blech. A teddy bear. Oh, a teddy bear. Oh, can I grab it? It's so cute no, and cannot. comforting. Oh, the doll blinked. God, go away. And the horse is rocking. The horse is rocking. Yeah, well, wind does that. I'm just gonna uh, say it's wind. I'm sure it's wind. None of you look at me. I don't want to talk to any of you. Don't do that. I saw you. Ah. Oh, this one. I can talk to this one. <laughs> oh, this is it gross. Stop. What the? <laughs> so Gabby okay. is... Okay. Go, go see if she needs anything. You okay over there? Yeah, she's... she's good she's just, just all right just chowing down on other gabby okay, okay I'm, sure. I'm gonna leave now yeah okay just oh god the heart oh no oh, oh that's freaky yeah hi my cat is like hi i heard you were having trouble except for he can't hear he's deaf yeah oh my god why aren't you more freaked out about this? Oh, it's gonna break on me, aren't you? Yep, it totally is. Can I uh. Oh, I cannot. Okay. Um. Ah! Yes. <laughs> Pick it up. Gross. Gross. Oh! What the? That is a dress form with an actual Yabby head on it, isn't it? Or the Glasgow smile. What's the Glasgow smile? When you tear, when you rip the, it's like the Joker. Oh, uh, well, yeah, I know it's like the Joker, but. That's what, it, that's called a Glasgow smile. Oh, okay. When you tear the um, cheek pouches. <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of gore for the sake of gore, but... Hey, there's a bear head on the wall. I don't think it was a lion. Whatever. Either way, it's dead. He's dead. Dead Jim. His name's Dead Jim? Yes. Dead Jim the lion. Okay. There was a joke in a Muppet Treasure Island where, like, one of the pirates' name was Tom. 
And this guy goes, Hey, old, or is it old Tom? Hey, another guy, another call. Oh, really old Tom. Hey, hey, somebody else. And then dead Tom. And then somebody holds up a skeleton. Good God. Oh, game. Oh, meat hooks. Yeah, this is this getting is, like, this, yeah, this like is fetishy almost, like fetishizing the, her brutality. Yeah, I'm just, uh. Like, I know that Thomas goes through brutal stuff, too, but it doesn't linger on him like this. Yeah. She's not in- he's never put in these prone positions. Oh, man. Oh, this game almost had me, too. Like, I can't think of a- Like, uh, I mean, I can think of things wrong with it, but not, like- at least it's not doing this sort of a thing. Yeah. It's like, but it's just not doing anything really, really gross. I mean, gross, but not that kind of gross. The Dark Descent. <laughs> I almost miss that game. I do too sometimes. Like, oh, miss you, Daniel. What the? Uh. What the? What is happening? It's a, uh, like an egg, like a uterus. Ew. Yeah. Okay. What? Dear Thomas. Oh, look. I'm leaving you. I'm sorry. You can't talk me out of it. I still love you, but I just can't be with you anymore. Losing our daughter was hard on me too, yet oh. I'm trying to move on. Your life didn't end. So why can't you live it? I hope you can get past this tragedy eventually. I really do. I guess this is goodbye. Love, Gabrielle. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, what was... Okay. So it was actually his daughter. Okay. Well, or that's just one. Right. Uh. When this one, like, it, he was, like, having dreams about his daughter. Well, I mean, okay. You could... Here's one way to look at it is, I don't like this. But you could say that the brutalization that we kept seeing of her mm -hmm. was manifestation of, like, her getting angry with him because he's not getting over it. Mm -hmm. So his mind, that's what his mind was doing. Like, it's like a way to punish her uh -huh. in his mind, I guess. Yeah. Which I don't like, and I think that's really super squicky. Um, and the evil little Gabby is the like the daughter haunting him right yeah so i mean that kind of makes sense but squiggy. there was there was a lot of kind of unnecessarily brutal imagery of G gabby gabriel yeah um and i mean i think the one that got me the most is the uh the the brief the, where there's pregnant in the stir in the yeah, yeah that one was not only was that unnecessary but it was really like there are a lot of like um uh depictions like that are that are like played for for shock of like horror the horrible things that can go wrong with a woman's pregnancy with you know yeah and I feel like that's just. Like, it didn't add anything. It was just for shock value. Yeah. It didn't, it was... I mean, I, I, uh, I mean, I could, I could analyze it that, oh, it's about, you know, losing their daughter and blah, blah, blah. But it's like, but this is, uh, this is just a girl in the refrigerator. Yeah. And, uh, I really like a lot of, I really liked a lot of these, but that one I did not. Yeah. Honestly, I think the one that I liked the best where it was just it was just a kid with a bad dream. Yeah, that one was Yeah, I think I liked that one the best. I think that was the creepiest. 
and it made the most sense logically right in the the grand scheme of things although the one where he woke up um like after, a after suicide being attempt. yeah after a suicide attempt that also makes a lot of sense but I did not like this last one though at all. This one, yeah, this last one was a little like un- it was unnecessary. But okay, so let's just let's let's cherry pick for a bit here and say that didn't happen. Like aside from that, which is obviously problematic and unnecessary and all that, um, I think that this is still a fantastic game. Uh, I think that the gameplay is really really creepy and um holds tension really well i think the art direction is spectacular what do you think i i I agree i really love the art direction playing the game was a lot different than i think watching it Uh uh-huh um i did have a couple people tell me um one of the guys from infinite errors uh who's a channel we're affiliated with um they were commenting in in this in the earlier videos saying that, like, they were kind of getting bored uh-huh. with it. And I totally get that. Like, watching it is a very different experience than actually, like, playing it. Yeah, and, like, I think it's different, like, the way that I watch it, because I'm actually, like, experiencing it with you versus, like, passive viewership of YouTube. Yeah. So this might be one of those games that you might have to play, but it's really, I don't know it's... if I could actually, like, recommend it because of all of the, just the imagery. Yeah, it's, it's, you gotta have a pretty strong stomach, not even stomach, just like, you gotta be able to stomach a lot of really triggery imagery, and as, if you suffer from any kind of mental illness, it can be really tough to see. Like, I have, I, I don't trigger easily with that sort of stuff, but even that was really tough, kind of, was hard for me to look at some of the time. Yeah. So, um... Yeah, I'm kind of sad that this guy's the guy that made this his his game his other game didn't get funded because I would have loved to see because this was his first game. Right? Yeah, I would love to see what he came up with later. I I remember watching like a, a a short little thing he had for the second game and I wasn't too impressed. Um, like well, maybe the gameplay got better, but like like if, if I remember correctly, it was just a woman getting killed. <laughs> Oh, that's, like, that's unfortunate. Uh, we, can right. do, we can do better. We know better. So Yeah, I mean, this game is a little old compared, like, for indie games. It's a couple years old. Yeah. I mean, good art direction. Fantastic art direction. Um, good concept. I liked how different it was. Yeah. I liked the side-scrolling. That yeah. was interesting. Yeah, and I'm not usually one for side-scrollers, but I, I enjoyed it. Um, it did interesting things. Yeah. I when horror comes up it's interesting to have a side scroller where things get revealed but a lot of it a lot of the horror was very subtle Mm -hmm. which i liked it was just like like murder and like small in the blocks like a lot of that stuff is very subtle and but this game could easily really get to a person like yeah like the image of the like the pictures on the wall, like there's the one of the the guy with his feet on the stool, and the next time it's the, him hanging. Like, yeah, man, that like if I was in a worse time, which right now I'm in kind of an okay time, that could be really that could really mess me up. Yeah, so, so I can't say that I necessarily recommend it. <laughs> I you know I would I would recommend it, but proceed with caution. Yeah, I would I recommend right, at least it. just trying it and, you know, experiencing the gameplay. Maybe not doing all of the endings, but just trying it. Yeah, I mean, if it, if anything, have it with a friend. <laughs> yeah, oh god, yeah. That's, that's probably, yeah, that's important. If you, if you have a mental illness, if you struggle with suicide ideation and everything, please do not play this game by yourself. Yeah. Because you risk messing yourself up. And if... If I, if I had seen this by myself, it would have been a different story. I mean, here's the thing, is that, like, a, a bunch of people have already played this game. We're not new to it. But we're coming at this from a perspective of, some, you know, two people who have suffered with mental illness, and a lot of it, and are continuing to deal with it, you know. So that's that's the perspective we're looking at this from. I mean, if you're fine, then you know, go for it. It's it's a scary game. Go for it. It's great, great art direction, um, gameplay is subtle. It's good. Uh, but coming at this from a mental illness standpoint, if you're suffering from depression and that sort of thing, this game can do some things to you if mm-hmm. you're not in the right state of mind. 
So, yeah. Uh, re- totally recommend it. Just proceed with caution. All right. I think that's all I've got to say about it. I think that's all I've got to say, too. Um, in the description below is also some links uh, to centers uh, for uh, hotline, hotline suicide, uh, mental health centers, things like that, in case anybody needs it. Please, 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 if you are having any kind... I know that we, we stress, this, stress this a lot, but please, if you are having any kind of um, problem where you think that you are getting to that point of no return, please reach out for help. There is help available. And please do not make a permanent solution to a temporary problem. Please, please reach out. Please get help. Um, we will put... Descript- we will put... Um, um links in the description to places you can get help otherwise i mean come talk to us on twitter if you need someone to talk to yep our twitters and tumblers are open and um i think that's it yeah my dms are open on twitter so feel free to if you need to talk to someone i'm always happy to talk to people who are having a hard time so take care of yourself guys Uh uh-huh you're all loved and uh you are all important Yes, you so, are. Be safe. We love you. And uh, aside that, from that, I think that's it. I think that's it. Like, favorites, comments, and subscribe. So, look, when stuff helps us grow this channel, lets us play a lot more games a lot more faster. Um, we have de- links in the description below for all of our social media, as well as the Patreon for Toxic Star Studio. And uh, Toxic Star Studio is my art studio, and we do all, I do all the artwork for the channel. Um, we are reworking the Patreon right now, but feel free to check it out. As of right now, for as little as a dollar a month, you can get a lot of cool stuff. You get to see everything early. Uh, plus, you get entered into drawings to win free art. So um, check that out. Become a patron if you can. Spreading the word helps, too. All right. Thanks, guys. Uh, that's it for me. I'm Rainbow. This is Hey.